Hey guys, so today we're going to talk about stoichiometry. The stoichiometry is a study of quantitative relationships between amounts of reactants used and products formed by a chemical reaction. Chemists love stoichiometry because it allows them to calculate or predict the amount of products used or the amount of reactants used or the amount of products formed using balanced equations. So there are three basic steps for stoichiometry. Step one is convert the given units of the mole, convert the given units to moles of the given substance. Step two, use the calculated moles and ratio of coefficients in the balanced equation to determine the moles of predicted substance. And last step, step three, convert the moles of the predicted substance back to the required units in the question. So that is whatever units you are asked to find. So our first example is given the following balanced equation, 2H2 gas plus O2 goes to 2H2O. Calculate the moles of water produced if 12.0 moles of hydrogen gas is completely reacted. So our question is already in moles, so we're going to skip step one of converting it to moles. So we have 2H2, and you put that over the 12.0 moles, and it's equal to 2H2O over X, because we're trying to find the number of moles. So you um, do cross multiplication, and you get that x is equal to 12.0 moles of H2O. So that question was pretty simple, stoichiometry. The second one is a little more tough. We're going to use the same balanced equation, but this time it says calculate the grams of water produced if 12.0 grams of hydrogen gas is completely reacted. So first we have to convert our grams to moles. So we have 12.0 grams of H2O. And um, if you watch our molar mass video, you will know how I find the molar mass of H2O, which is 2.0158 grams per mole. And then the grams cancel and you get your moles, so you get 5 point nine five moles of H2 gas. So we'll just erase that so we have room to do our other work so we know that we have 5.95 moles. Remember that. So we're going to do the same thing as we did up above. We're going to go 2 H2 gas over 5.95 moles is equal to 2 H2O over X. And we're trying to find X, so we do our cross multiplication again. And we get that X is equal to 5.95 moles of H2O. But in the question, it asks us to find the grams of water produced, not the moles of water. So now we have to convert our moles back to grams. So we find the molar mass of H2O, which we you know is 18.0158 grams per mole. And we multiply that by the moles of H2O, which is 5.95 moles. Our moles are going to cancel again. And for the grams of H2O, we get that our final answer is 107 point grams of H2O. So 107 grams is our final answer. Hopefully that helped you with your stoichiometry problems.